is this? <laughs> Stutter. I don't think I could. For ever all do its that. material advantages, the sedentary life has left us edgy, unfulfilled. Even after 400 generations in villages and cities, we haven't forgotten. The open road still softly calls, like a nearly forgotten song of childhood. places with a certain romance. The appeal, I suspect, has been meticulously crafted by natural selection as an essential element in our survival. Long summers, mild winters, rich harvests, plentiful game, none of them lasts forever. Your own life, or your bands, or even your species might be owed to a restless few drawn by a craving they can hardly articulate or understand to undiscovered lands and new worlds. Stay with the dude. Okay, you're on fire. Okay, okay, you're on fire. Three, seven. I'd say no, I get a good contact. Yeah, lead. yeah, the spirit. Okay, we watched that to begin with. Execute. Herman Melville in Moby Dick spoke for wanderers in all epochs and meridians. He said, I am tormented with an everlasting itch for things remote. I love to sail forbidden seas. Algorithms, the algorithms are on it. You guys are finding some amazing, amazing videos. Uh, if you are here for Dungeons and Dragons, don't worry. We'll be starting it. We're running a little late here. Our Star Citizen party has gone a little crazy and wild, and we love it. Uh, so we'll start Dungeons and Dragons around 10. So just buckle up and hold in if you're here for Dungeons and Dragons. Um, this is part two from the same dude. First off, I'm going to link this because this guy needs some serious props. That was awesome. I love the narration. I love the effort that was put into this. Those shots were cinematic bliss. Uh, this dude's name, I'm subscribing. He only has 30 subscribers. I am going to put this link in once more. You guys better get your butts over there and like that because that was awesome. That deserves a lot more attention. Only 620 views. Let's help this dude out. Let's boost this dude's number past 30, for God's sake. I subscribed. Now, here is the second part to his cinematic. Space is open to us now. And our eagerness to share its meaning is not governed by the efforts of others. We go into space because whatever mankind must undertake, free men must fully share. Above and beyond the increases I have earlier requested for space activities to provide the funds which are needed to meet the following national goals. I believe that this nation should commit itself to 
achieving the goal before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the Earth. No single space project in this period will be more impressive to mankind or more important for the long-range exploration of space, and none will be so difficult or expensive to accomplish. We propose to accelerate the development of the appropriate lunar spacecraft. We propose to develop alternate liquid and solid fuel boosters, much larger than any now being developed, until certain which is the period. additional funds for other engine development and for unmanned exploration. Explorations which are particularly important for one purpose which this nation will never overlook. The survival of the man who first makes this daring flight. But in a very real sense, it will not be one man going to the moon. We make this judgment affirmatively. It will be an entire nation. Futz, you're right. We're going to give you your trucker horn for calling that out, buddy. It is magic, dude. It is. And Futz is calling it like he sees it. This guy's good, man. I'm going to like that one, too. And there is one last part he's got. Dude, he took the Tron. Did he take Tron and slow it down? He took that track, and he actually slowed it down. That was that was tight. What's up, Malcolm? Good to have you here live on stream, buddy. Malcolm's a cool dude. Every once in a while, Malcolm, I get in the DMs. It gets a little hot. Look, it's a little hot and sweaty with Malcolm. No, just teasing. <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> oh, this is, these are all so good. From this distant vantage point, the Earth might not seem of any particular interest. But for us, it's different. Consider again that dot. That's here. That's home. That's us. On it, everyone you love, everyone you know, everyone you ever heard of, every human being who ever was, lived out their lives. The aggregate of our joy and suffering, thousands of confident religions, ideologies, and economic doctrines, every hunter and forager, Every hero and coward, every creator and destroyer of civilization. Every king and peasant, every young couple in love, every mother and father, hopeful child, inventor and explorer, every teacher of morals, every corrupt politician, every superstar, every supreme leader, every saint and sinner in the history of our species lived there on the moat of dust. What's up, Vander? Wow, we got a lot of new faces tonight. Let's get an amen for all the new faces tonight. I know there's like a 10 minute block. Yes, sir. Listen. You're gonna eat me. Yes. Appreciate all the new follows. I know that's primarily because of Looney, which uh, I would also like to give an amen to Looney once again for rating us with yes, tons of, You're tons of amazing yes. people. And uh, also to Aldo, who did the same thing. Let's get an amen to Aldo. We're getting rated tonight. I like yes, this. Sir. Thank You're you so much. Super props to Aldo and uh, super props to Looney for helping us out tonight. We hit a record. We hit over like 200 viewers tonight, uh, which is quite awesome. I think that's our, I think that is a record. 
I think that's a record. So uh, we're making history tonight. Making history. By the way, what piece of music is this that Sagan is talking? First off, the Pale Blue Dot speech by Sagan is amazing. But what is also the soundtrack? What What am I listening to? This amazing guitar solo being played in the background. This guy's got a great recipe for success. He's taken famous speeches of our time. He's mixing them with amazing music and giving us eye candy. It's like the, the entire experience is, is just amazing. But if somebody knows the name of this track, this guitar gently weeping like this, it's, it's fantastic. Suspended in a sunbeam. We're going to be streaming both days. The yes. earth is a very small stage in a vast cosmic arena. Yeah, but I don't care, Elsie. Think of the rivers of blood spilled by all those generals and emperors so that in glory and triumph they could become the momentary masters of a fraction of a dot. Think of the endless cruelties visited by the inhabitants of one corner of this pixel on the scarcely distinguishable inhabitants of some other corner. How frequent their misunderstandings. How eager they are to kill one another. How fervent their hatreds. Absolutely stunning. I'm not about the money, bro. Damn, that is a nice track. I gotta know what this is from. Our planet is a lonely speck. Obscurity. In all this vastness, there is no hint that help will come from elsewhere to save us from ourselves. All right, it's in there. It's in the description. It is in the description. It's just called Somber, a guitar instrumental. Somber. Wow, that is a fantastic track right there. That was that was awesome. What a great recipe for success. That is, this guy deserves, if I could push the subscribe button a thousand times, I would literally push the subscribe button for a thousand times for this dude. Let's go over there. <clears throat> I'm going to link this for everyone so you guys can go over there and support this awesome dude who definitely deserves the support. Uh, and I just loved it. I, I loved all of this. Like, first off... Like, the shots are fantastic. To get those types of shots in games, not not so easy. The way he edited them together, also fantastic. Uh, I would like Cloud Imperium to use this guy for, for commercials. <laughs> like, this is how good this guy is, man. So, uh, very, 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 very cool. I like him. Uh, Castro Dynamica. All right. Very cool.